Biosecurity is critical in keeping pigs healthy, and the implementation of biosecurity practices, no matter the production type, can help to reduce risk. Alternative pork production presents unique challenges for biosecurity. This video, the first in a short series, will help explain how to avoid the introduction and spread of disease on the farm. Alternative pork production is defined as farms that are non-mainstream types and may identify as niche, pasture pork, hoop barns, traditional pork, or heritage breeds, among other types of alternative production. Some alternative pork producers raise pigs without using antibiotics, except when necessary for disease treatment. Biosecurity is very important to all swine operations, but improved biosecurity is a vital management strategy to maintain herd health in the absence of an antibiotic treatment. This video will focus on risk events that could bring pathogens onto the farm and illustrate how a virus spreads, regardless of how infrequent the event may occur. Risk events can be farmer, caretaker, or visitor entry onto the farm, transportation of pigs, including delivery to market, arrival of new breeding stock or weaned pigs, feed delivery, repairs by outside contractors, wildlife, such as birds, rodents, and pests. Research at Iowa State University found that some of the highest risk events related to disease outbreaks involve pathogens being carried onto a farm by people, animals, or supplies. Two of the highest risk events for alternative production are people entering the production area and delivery of hogs to market. Even feed delivery, manure removal, and outside barn repair can lead to pathogens tracked onto the farm. Thinking about biosecurity in terms of risk events helps us to focus prevention efforts. As we look for high risk events, watch and see how pathogens may be tracked onto the farm with these demonstrations. This example shows how a vehicle or farm equipment could transfer a pathogen onto the farm. This example shows how pathogens could be picked up on the shoes of the farmer, caretaker, or visitors while off the farm. In summary, people entering production areas and delivery of hogs to market are the highest biosecurity risks for alternative pork production. In the next video, we'll focus on strategies that can help reduce those risks.